guys, I just finished my geopolitics meeting, so we were actually meeting the leaders of a podcast that geopolitics ran, Bronx, which is called uh, Fly on the Wall, which is covering about how the communications team can better work with the Fly on the Wall podcast team to better promote as well as market and adv advertise uh, this podcast. So definitely check out the podcast if you're interested in learning more about how geopolitics functions. Uh, then I have a then I have a tabling event for an hour from 12 to 1 p.m. That's for uh, the student government uh, because I'm one of the senators uh, on the government. So I'll be tabling events to promote what student government actually does and also um, to get more interest and also ask the students to sign up for different coalitions, policy coalitions, as well as different working groups. And I think that'll be really interesting for them to know more about how the student government at Georgetown functions as well. Then after the 1 p.m. tabling event, I'll be going to my um, my work. So I'm working at the Georgetown Investment Office, which is um, which manages manages the school endowment. And also I'll be working there from to 1 to around 6 p.m. tonight. And then I'll be getting back before having another Guelph School Georgetown University Alumni Student Federal Credit Union shift at 6.30. So I'll just take you guys along with me on this Friday, beautiful Friday day. See you guys soon. <laughs> Looking good, man. Looking good. How are you doing? I'm just doing some filming. What do you have, class now? Yeah. What do you have? Um, I have like three classes in a row. I have. Shit, really? Uh, yeah, class. On Friday? Yeah. Do you always have. Like oh, that's fine, yeah. Have fun, man. See ya. So, this is my room. This is my side. And, uh,. Those, this is my closet. Those are some of my pictures from the past. That's my, uh, that's the poster while I was running for the student government senate position. That's a Wolf of Wall Street poster. And uh, those are just some of the vintage uh, presidential campaign posters from FDR all the way to Bill Clinton in 1992. And those are some of the vintage posters from the past. Landing on the moon, uh, Nixon going to China, and as well as some of the classic movies that I really like. Avengers Endgame, Iron Man, The Godfather, and also this French movie called The Choir, which is a really good movie. That's a, that's a Bill Clinton poster when he was running for the student government's president position. Uh, when he was at Georgetown. So normally on Friday before I go to work, I normally go to a ramen place right opposite uh, of Georgetown Cupcake, which is really the famous cupcake shop in the Georgetown neighborhood. And the ramen place is called Kintaro. So I normally go there, order some ramen and also order some sushi. And I'll probably be taking you guys there as well.
Hey guys, so I'm currently at my office conference room and this is where we have meetings with fund managers uh, such as hedge fund managers, venture capital fund managers, private equity fund managers and I guess I'll just use this opportunity to talk about what I'm involved in on campus both extracurricularly wise and also what classes I'm taking on campus so I'll start off with what classes I'm taking first so I'm a sophomore student in the School of Foreign Service at Georgetown University in Washington DC and I'm planning to major in international political economy which is a combination of both politics, uh, international relations as well as uh, economics and I think just from taking different classes, economic classes in my freshman year, I really enjoyed uh, learning more about how economics and politics actually function together, both domestically and also on the world stage. That's why I'm planning to major in international political economy. And I'm taking five classes this semester. And uh, extracurricularly wise, I'm, I like to divide my extracurricular activities into three different sections. Those three different sections are uh, research, uh, finance, business, and also um, uh, politics. So for my first area, and for each of those three sections, uh, I'm involved with two organizations or two different roles for each of those three sections. So under the section of research, I'm the teaching assistant for the principal of macroeconomic class where I teach classes, as well as attending office hours, hosting office hours for students to answer, to answer students' questions. And my second involvement under my research section is my involvement with the Center for Security and Emerging Technology, which is a think tank that is hosted inside Georgetown University campus. And uh, it's a think tank quite new, it's actually quite new, it just started at the start of this year. So it's a think tank that solely focuses on artificial intelligence and how artificial intelligence will impact public policy in the future. Uh, I'm doing research with them, especially looking into China's AI industry, as well as how China, as well as the United States, are using artificial intelligence to advance their own economy, as well as their military uh, advantages. Uh, I think it's a very interesting, interesting topic to do research on. And my second uh, section uh, under my extracurricular activity is finance slash business. So I'm involved with the Georgetown Investment Office where I'm doing research into different fund managers as well as looking into how we can maximize our endowment sites. And my second involvement with under the finance section is my involvement with Guasco, Georgetown University Alumni Federal Credit Union. I'm an operations manager there where I do daily transactions with members of uh, the credit union and I think it's really rewarding to actually know both other students at the credit union as well as interacting with members. And uh, my last section for my extracurricular activity is my involvement with politics. So on my politics, uh, I'm a student senator for the Georgetown University Student Association or the student government at Georgetown University. Uh, I just got elected last month in September. Uh, so we had a, a whole election process where students have to vote for their senators as well as for student body president and student body vice president. So I'm lucky enough uh, to be one of the members on the Senate this year. And I'm also helping out with the communications team on the Senate side of, for Georgetown University Alumni, uh, Student Association. And I'm, I'm attending weekly meetings regarding how uh, the student body and how the student government can better help the student body, as well as running their communications team. And my second involvement under the politics section is that I'm the communications chair for the Georgetown University politics, geopolitics or institute of politics and public service, where I have to promote school events 
as well as um, speaker events on campus and also off campus. Uh, I think one of my biggest roles for geopolitics is just to maximize and try to adver advertise geopolitics as much as I can. And I think this really has been really rewarding for me in the past few uh, months. And I've, I've definitely learned a lot about communication strategies and also as well as how to advertise and also how to market a, a bigger and also growing audience faster. So I'm really, I really enjoy taking my classes as well as my extracurricular activities. Hey, what's up? What's your name? Abraham. And what are you doing? Right now? Yeah. Oh, in, in school? In school, yeah, in school. In school, I intern on the hill and I participate oh. in case competitions in MSB. Oh, big flex. What happens, um, what happened, like, what did you tell me, like, five minutes ago? What did I tell you? Oh, I received an internship with the FBI for this summer. Hey guys, it's currently Monday evening and I just came back from my student government senate meeting. Uh, in the meeting, we had a few uh, senate confirmations about policy chairs that we just appointed to different policy groups. And we also passed some two re resolutions. One is on the recognition of indigenous, indigenous people's day and also another one is about improving club culture on campus. And now I'm just about to head into the business school to do some study as well as promoting the Georgetown Investment Office uh, recruiting event on campus this week. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have fun. Hey guys, I'm here for the Democratic Debate Watch Party and I'll be helping out with the media and social media promotion as well. Hey guys, it's currently 2.30 a.m. on Wednesday and I'm just heading back from the library back to the dorm. Um, I think at the moment I have done the week, a week in my life a video, but uh, Mark Zuckerberg is coming to campus on Thursday, which is tomorrow. And I would love to show you guys for that event as well. So I will just, at the end, I will just add an additional clip uh, for the Mark Zuckerberg event. And also I will be promoting the event on the Georgetown University YouTube ch uh, Instagram channel as well. So I would love to see uh, what's happening on Thursday night and also on Thursday afternoon. So I'll keep you guys updated and thank you so much again for uh, keeping myself b busy this week for the past week. I have definitely really enjoyed uh, vlogging for the Crimson Education YouTube channel as well. And definitely follow the Crimson Education if you want to know more about college in general. See you guys soon.